Hey everyone, Mike here from AffiliateMarketerTraining.com and in this video I just want to go over real quick how to use internet forums to find great new article ideas and uh, keywords directly from your target audience. So I'm going to use my own website as an example. Um, I own a website called DogFoodInsider.com which reviews dog food and I give basic uh, dog nutrition and health advice and it's also got a forum, so I'm always looking for new topics and, uh, and ideas, things to write about. So what I'm going to do is type in dog food forum, and with your niche, obviously you just replace dog food with whatever, uh, you know, if you have a, a website teaching people how to play the guitar, you, know, you type in guitar forum. Um, I have a safe driving website, so I could type in driving forum. Um, you know, whatever your niche is, just type in forum, you're almost guaranteed to find something in your niche. Um, almost every niche has some sort of a forum these days. So I'm just going to go to the top one here, Dog Food Forum at dogfoodchat.com. And once I get in, you're going to notice most forums, not all of them, but most forums will have these different subsections. Okay, so try to drill down and get as targeted as you can. Uh, the computer's acting all slow here. Uh, but try to get as targeted as you can. So. Um, what I'm going to go to is dry and canned dog food because that's primarily what my website uh, does. It's re that's pretty relevant to my website. So here we are. Everything's kind of running slow because I've got this screen capture software running, but uh, do the best we can here. It's on top. All of these stickies now. For whatever reason, whoever's running this forum believes that these topics here are very important. They want everybody to see this. They want a lot of people to come visit. Uh, I mean, some of these things have, have been up there since 2008, okay, 2010, another 2008. So this is something that is obviously pretty popular. So let's pay attention to these stickies first. And you're going to notice the top one right here, top five dog food brands. Well, there you go. That was a pretty good article idea right there. Um, and I don't have to do five, I can do the top three, I can do the top 12 or the top 50, um, you know, whatever I felt like doing, but uh, there's one idea right there. Um, dog food coupons and special deals. I could write an article on uh, how to find dog food coupons and special deals online, or, uh, or just basic, you know, how to find dog food coupons and special deals. Uh, poop chart, well, that's probably something, I might feel a little creative about that. I don't know if I can turn that into an article idea. But I'll just go through each one of these, and I can also scroll down, and this is sort of like real-time stuff here. So all these posts on top are obviously going to be recent. We can see what people in, your, in, in my target audience are talking about and questions that they have. So like here's one here. Anyone heard of a dog food called Nulo? Now, I've never heard of this food. We do not have a, re a review of this on dogfoodinsider.com. I see that there are four pages, so there's people participating in this, there's people interested in this food, so I might have to consider writing a review for new low dog food. Um, here's another one, natural choice grain free, and I think we already have an article on this, natural choice grain free dog food would be the article that I have. Um, and we just basically go down the line here, kibble for UTI bladder stones, so I could write an article about that. Uh, dry skin, I could write an article Maybe the title will be the best dog food for dogs with dry skin. And you can see, I mean, this is just the first page of, I mean, there's going to be a ton. I mean, it says 101 here, but I'm sure there's probably, oh, here we go. It actually pops up. So there's 2,487 pages just within this subcategory of this one forum about dog food. And there are plenty of forums out there about dogs in general and about dog food. So um, this is what I mean, guys. Just dive into these forums, find a forum in your niche, and get out a, a spreadsheet and just start finding all these article ideas and put them, plug them in on a spreadsheet because a lot of these uh, titles, these, uh, these topic titles that people put in, these are the same type of general keywords they're going to be putting in to a search engine. So, um, you know, these are almost SEO optimized for you already because you're getting these titles and these keywords directly from your audience. So obviously you want to use your discretion. Some of them you're going to want to reword a little bit, 
but it gives you a good idea of what people are looking for and uh, new articles that you can write on your blog. And these pages, these posts, will people add posts every day, all the time on different forums. So you're always going to have fresh batches. You can always keep up with the you know going trends and things that are happening uh, within your niche. And you can always remain relevant and get these relevant, fresh, new ideas all the time. So make sure you're using forums, guys. There's a lot of good keyword research tools and things out there. If you want some more tips, come and visit me at affiliatemarketertraining.com. Uh, you'll also see a free seven-day affiliate marketing e-course there where I will help you open uh, the doors to your own affiliate marketing company within just one week, within seven days. So I highly recommend you come and check it out. It's totally free. Again, that's at affiliatemarketertraining.com. And I hope this helped you guys. Take care.